Today, I want to show you something I bet you've never seen. Hey, it's Monday morning, y'all. Let's get her done. You know, it's been a while since we talked about tools of faith. So what's a tool of faith? Well, it's anything that you can use to help you stay strong and keep the faith on your intentional faith journey. Now today I want to share with you one of my many tools and I'm betting many of you have never seen this before. Here it is. Yes, yeah, this little booklet. See that? Back in World War II, a young man named George Tulloch was a 20-year-old sergeant in the 82nd Airborne. And George was part of the airborne invasion of Normandy on the night before D-Day in June of 1944. And it was George's mom that put this booklet together and sent it to him um, some months prior to D-Day. And here's how she explains this booklet. Some months ago, we sent George a pocket-sized notebook in which I had copied a number of poems, excerpts, and Bible verses. We felt that in the lonely, anxious, and trying experiences he was passing through, a few moments reading of these might give him hope and strength. Since he wrote us that a number of times that he had received much help from reading it, we are duplicating it in this booklet. Our desire and prayer is that other boys who read it may receive an inspiration and help from the thoughts of great minds and souls of the past and present. And so what makes this book really cool is its total randomness. I mean, there are no chapters. It's 30 straight pages of inspiration written in no particular order. Some of the passages list an author, some don't. Some of the passages are written by people you've heard of, some by people you've never heard of. So this morning, I want to give you just a taste of what a paratrooper's faith is all about. And I'm going to read you a brief poem called, No Need to Worry. There's no author listed. And I've chosen this one because when you consider everything going on in the world today, uh, this is the kind of message we need to hear. It helps me to stay strong and keep the faith. Here we go. No need to worry. I cannot read the future and I do not need to know the things that will befall me as through this world I go. I have a faithful guide. Now, guide is capitalized, of course. And if I always do my best, I have no need to worry, for God will do the rest. Let trouble overtake me. Let hardship be my lot. Let bitter opposition fondest expectations blot. No anxious care shall press my soul. No need have I to fear, and I shall not worry. For God is ever near. Whew. Well, sadly, George Tulledge was wounded on the morning of June 6, 1944, and he died of his wounds two days later. He was awarded the Bronze Star for gallantry. Thankfully, George's family has kept a paratrooper's faith alive all these years. There's actually a website, and I'm going to leave the link below, where you can go learn more about George, but more importantly, they're going to send you a free copy of A Paratrooper's Faith if you want to, for no charge at all. What do you think about that? All right, so what's the takeaway for this week? Well, it's this. Tools of faith are extraordinarily important and essential if you're going to remain intentional in your faith. They just are. And you never know where you're going to find a tool. I will share with you one of these days where I found this. Some of you know where I found this little gem right here, and I highly recommend you get yourself a copy. So, for today, that's a wrap. As always, may the Lord of Peace Himself give you peace at all times and in every way. The Lord be with all of you. Until next week, you guys, stay strong, keep the faith. We'll see you then.